Merhaba arkadaşlar, hepiniz IFT Talks webinarlarına hoş geldiniz. Bugün University of Humanities and Economics in Lausanne'dan Casper bize ekonomik ve kaliteli eğitim Polonya'da yaşam hakkında bilgi veriyor olacak. Lütfen sorularınızı questions kısmından sormayı unutmayın. Yes Casper, the stage is yours now. Thank you Zeynep. First of all, I would like to send my my warm greetings to all interested in our university, all, um, all pupils, students, parents, and other participants of this of this meeting. Um, I just I will show you now a presentation about our our university, so you can find out about us more. Okay, um, let's start from Poland. Poland is a country with over 38 million inhabitants located in central part of Europe. Poland is a beauty of, of a combination of wonderful landscapes, charming villages, and large dynamically developing cities. The location, rich culture, culture and great beauty, beautiful long history make it an ideal place to start your studies and professional career. Poland is also a country situated between mountains and the sea, thanks to the thanks to the uh, to which students have many opportunities to spend their free time pleasantly. Our international students love to travel around the country. Um, now you can find out some facts about uh, about connections between Poland and Turkey because our um, we have a strong and long-lasting historical and diplomatic relations. It's over 600 years. Um, for example, Turkey has never recognized the partitions of Poland in uh, 18th century. We have also a, a lot of words in our language taken from Turkish. Um, strong connections we have also with the second country we are going to uh, to uh, to invite students, Azerbaijan, where a, where a big Polish community working was working to built the capital of Azerbaijan, uh, for example, some engineers and architects. About city of Łódź, where we are situated, it's a city of four cultures. Mm. This is the third largest city in Poland, located in the central part of the country uh, and has a long-lasting industrial uh, history since 19th century because of its history of love, tolerance and acceptance and thanks to the charm of the city and, and beauty is a home of hundreds of students from different countries and cultures. Lodz is not only an attractive place to study but also guarantees a job for professionals in many fields like IT, PPO services, starts up and many more. Currently, which is the fastest growing city in Poland. Moreover, it's positioned in ranking as one of the most interesting tourist destinations in the world. Now let's uh, let's go to our university, University of Humanities and Economics in Łódź. Mm. Why you should choose uh, AAG in Łódź? Because you will study in the center of Europe, uh, and which gives you a chance to travel throughout the Schengen area without any restrictions, having the student status and visa. 
you will get also a European, European diploma. A part of this, we are one of the largest and oldest private universities in Poland, established in 1993. We have already been entrusted with, by over 85,000 students from all over Europe and other world countries. We have teaching for 20 years and we know how to prepare you, you for success in European labor market. Our other um, our other advantages are flexible curricula of, of studies tailored to the needs of our students. Uh, having a student status, you can work uh, and gain important experience on the labor market. Our university supports and develops creativity and needed, so needed in, the, in many careers paths. Uh, our programs are designed to, uh, to put a stress on creative development of students. Being a student of AAG, you will participate in internship programs both in Poland and abroad. Uh, you, you will use modern project methods, practice and training like coaching. You can participate in Erasmus program and get an experience in European companies, universities and other institutions. To maintain a high level of education, AHE provides modern and convenient infrastructure. The student hostels, the clinical, the clinic, sports center, TV and uh, radio studio, computer rooms, large library and couple of art galleries. About our potential, as I said before, we have already 28 years of experience in university level teaching. We have eight, more than 85,000 graduates, six departments in which and six uh, didactic branch centers in Poland. We have also the largest in the Eastern Europe distance learning platform, which is very usable, especially during this uh, today, uh, today times with, uh, with uh, coronavirus epidemic. Um, we offer also more than 100 postgraduate studies. We have huge and modernly equipped spaces in 19th century post-industrial renovated buildings. You can study in English, Russian and Polish, of course. We have excellent, experienced and friendly academic staff. In our offer, you will find bachelor degree studies like political science, management, graphics, tourism and recreation, in master degree, you can you can find political science and management. Uh, from the October 2000 uh, to 2021, we will have also in master degree uh, computer science studies and graphics. In engineer degree, you can study computer science with two specializations programming technologies and ICT networks. When you finish your studies at AHG, you get a diploma that confirms your academic degree. This is a diploma not only a proof of education and academic degree received, but also it is all recognized and accepted diploma all over the world. We are preparing also a special a uh, special degree, which will be a MBA program uh, in cooperation with one of the American universities. It will be Fort Hayes State University. About this, we will find out more soon. Our graduates, uh, you, can, you can see them here. 
like Thomas from computer science department, he's from Germany, Anastasia from Ghana, Amanda and Christina of graphics major. We have also a big uh, a dance department. Uh, our university is well known in Poland for teaching dance. Part of the University of Humanities and Economics in which is Polish Virtual University. This is a platform of online teaching. It's a unique solution in times of a worldwide pandemic. Polish Virtual University is engaged in the dissemination of modern teaching methods. For more than a decade, it is the oldest and largest distance learning university in Central and Eastern Europe. More than 20,000 graduates have graduated from the virtual campus of our university. Learning online, online, you will gain the ability to learn anywhere at any time. The free access to a modern platform uh, to the, to the up-to-date information and to the best teachers. You will get free, freely combined studying with work and family opportunity. You will also save money because you, will not, you would not have to travel a lot. How the Polish Virtual University looks like? Um, it is a um, distance learning platform, fully online, um, which contains training materials, tasks, tests, quizzes, topics for discussions at the forum, along with the training requirements. Through this platform, you have be you you can be in constant constant um, uh, connection with the teachers. You will work there in, there in groups led by outstanding and experienced professors who provide answers to your questions, moderate discussions and define tasks and evaluate the implementations. You can communicate with the teacher there and your classmates through a dis discussion forum, chat and email. We are implementing implementing a unique educational idea, which we call um, technology if, of creativity. Uh, we are focusing on each student separately and uh, we treat the students individually. We help them to develop their passions and interests, but most of all, we support their creative ideas and approach to the solving problems. We are discovering the, their hiding, hidden abilities and possibilities. We think that everyone can be creative. What else can we offer? Our university is not only a high level of education and innovative solutions stimulating the creativity and in the ingenuity of our students, but also helping communication and well-equipped teaching facilities. For example, Arterion Studio, which is a professional cinema and television studio where, you, where, uh, um, where, make, where it make it possible to connect communication technology and several other forms of information transfer, for example, text, sound, graphic, animation, video. Our TV studio is fully, fully equipped, enable, enabling to the creation of television programs, promotional and educational films, music videos, and video product for the internet. This is a space with a full technical base where the students of our university practice their skills and show how they are connected with both study major and individual interests. We have also art galleries for students and our partners. This is a space of creative, educational, animated events 
realized in the field of art on the basis of academic didactics. The main goal of uh, goal and mission of our galleries is to support scientific development of the Department of Arts, as well as support the artistic activity of students from all majors. The activities that take place here are the representation of the students, teachers and invited artists achievements. The mission of the galleries is cooperation with artists, students, cultural centers, as well as the organization of exhibitions and seminars. Our students have an opportunity to participate in Erasmus Plus program. This is an exchange program between our university and other universities, mm, not only for the students, but also for the teachers. The program supports international cooperation of universities, provides the opportunity for students to travel abroad for studying or their internships, promotes mobility of university staff, creates opportunities for universities to participate in projects with foreign, foreign partners. University of Humanities and Economics in which has been actively participating in the Erasmus program for many years, which enables students of bachelor and master degree of full-time and part-time studies to study and practice abroad. Studies can last one semester or one academic year. Internships can last three months. If you become our students, you will have a chance to go to, the, to one of the several dozens of prestigious universities all over Europe. Thanks to the funds from the European Union, you will receive a high scholarship every month during your, during your stay abroad. Now I will show you a short video promoting our promoting our students and our university. <laughs> Thank you for watching the video. Here you can find the contact information to the university. First of all, our email address, which is study at aag.logz.pl, our web page, and you can, you can uh, find us on Facebook also. Mm, now let me answer to your questions. Anyone have questions, please? Hi, Kasper. Uh, near chat box, you can see questions box. Oh, OK. With, with us is our friend, Mr. Professor Nechati Sazuas, which 
who is our partner in Turkey and also in the United States. Hello, Nechat. Um, answering to the question of Setney Varol, are graduate programs in English language? Yes, all the programs which I show you are in English language, like management, graphics, political science, tourism and recreation, uh, and computer science. Mm, answering to the question of Mustafa about the, the how much money do I require for studying there? Uh, our tuition fee is um, is really affordable com uh, comparing to the other universities in Europe and in Poland, uh, especially with com uh, comparing to the other universities in Europe. Uh, studying in Poland and in at AAG in Lut in Łódź is very affordable because. Uh, the costs of living in Poland uh, are much lower than in other cities in Europe. Uh, the tuition fee for most of our programs is 3,100 3, euro. Um, answering to the question of Faiza Yalcin, yes, you have a work permit while you are students. Students in Poland having a valid visa and student status have a full access to the labor market. Uh, you can f find a job in any area, in any dimension of hours, like you can you can study full time or part time, and a lot of our students uh, study and work. Uh, we try also to make our programs and and schedules to be convenient for working students. Any other questions? Hi, Casper. While we wait other questions, could you please share your email address on chat box, please? Of course. My email address is study at agldzpl. This is a general email to our uh, international department. My personal uh, working email is You can find you can find us also on our website. Here you can find all our programs in English language. If you have any questions, feel free to catch me on email. I will answer to all your uh, questions and give you the detailed information. Faiza is asking how long it, it takes um, application process. First of all, you should fill in the application form 
on our university website. Then within uh, two, three days, you will get an answer from us to send all the documents required and instructions uh, about the next steps in the recruitment process. Um, from the part of the university, you can do that within a week. Uh, how fast you will get visa, it usually depends on the consular departments in, uh, in, the, uh, in the particular countries. It, it should be in a few weeks. If you have more questions now, feel free to ask. Here you can see um, our website, our English website and programs, choosing programs in English. You can find our um, all programs in English language. Here you can find um, information about tuition fees and other fees. And to make an application, just click the yellow admission button. And then you will be directed to the uh, application for here you are choosing the language of studies which is prefer preferably English, and the, um, the faculties and fields of studies. Then you, here you can find the required documents to, to each program, and confirming this, you, uh, you will be registered filling in this form with your personal data, like email address, first name, surname. After the registration, uh, you will get an email with confirmation of registration, and you will be directed to fill in other information about you. Answering to a question of Hassan, yes, we have graphic design program. In graphic design, we have uh, two specialties, which is multimedia and video uh, and video making. And the other specialty, very innovative uh, in the European uh, market of studies, is 3D graphics and computer design and computer game design, which is very popular among the students. Mm, answering to question of Bolut Celik, um, as the university, uh, we do not require the health insurance. However, to come to Poland and get visa, you have to have a health insurance which covers at least uh, one year health exp expenses uh, in uh, like for the visits in physicians or some uh, other uh, health issues so you should have this health insurance uh, for one year at least Feza is asking about life and living expenses in Poland. Uh, as I told before, the uh, living expenses in Poland are comparatively 
um, lower than in other European countries and European cities. Um, cost of, uh, for example, of renting a, uh, a room in a student um, student house is about uh, 500 euro. Also, the uh, the food is quite cheap in Poland, and because we we are a, a rural uh, rural country, so we have an access to the uh, fresh vegetables and uh, and fruits. Uh, I can recommend you Polish Polish cuisine and Polish Polish dishes are are very good and very um, very healthy. Um, I will get all all your emails after the after the presentation, so I will contact with you and I can share with you the detailed information also about the all the prices of in Poland of the uh, accommodation and life expenses, living expenses. Mm. Asrin Demir is asking about the precessional pre English. Yes, we offer a course of English language, which is a preparation course for studies. Um, if you will send an email with us to us, I can share with you the details about this course. This is one year course um, and contains 60 600 hours of lectures. Kasper, also, could you please mention about uh, how is the University of Humanities and Economics and Lots coping with the current situations? Like, do you have online or hybrid classes? Mm, yes, right now all the classes are online uh, in this semester and in the summer semester, which starts in March, probably also. Uh, we have this uh, online teaching platform, which is especially designed uh, for uh, online lectures. Mm, in this platform, all the students have their classes scheduled there have uh, the meetings with the teachers. They can find there all the assignments or, or the teaching materials. Mm. And yes, this, uh, this is a very good tool for this uh, coronavirus situation. Of course, when the situation improve we will get back to the on campus teaching which is which is much better method of teaching because it's the the contact face to face contact with the teacher is um, is the is the best way Yes, I think we have a new question about yes. the Polish lessons. Yes, we can also offer you a Polish lessons program, a course of Polish language. Mm, but many of our students uh, have no idea about Polish language and they come to Poland, come to which city, and they can, uh, they can, uh, it is possible for them to, to, to find themselves and 
uh, learn Polish during the studies. Also, uh, in our studies program, uh, in the curricula, there is uh, there are the Polish lessons. But also, of course, if you if you would like to learn Polish language before coming to Poland, it's it's a very good idea. About application deadlines, uh, we have two application to admission time in a year for summer semester and for winter semester. Um, application right now, applications uh, for summer semester going on. Uh, the deadline actually is Jan end of January, but probably it will be extended to the mid of February. Uh, the summer semester starts from the 1st of March. Next intake for, uh, for winter semester starts in April and lasts until the end of August. Any questions more? Sentinel, Sentinel is asking about the requirements for entering the university. First of all, you have to have a, um, a final uh, a final diploma of your high school of uh, secondary secondary living certificate which gives you an access to the university level education in turkey if you have a certificate confirming that you are able to undertake the studies in turkey you have the same right in poland so the basis to be admitted to studies is the secondary school living certificate and uh, making payment of the tuition fee and other fees and being able to come to Poland. Um, Irfan is, about, is asking about the summer semester. Yes, it starts maybe quite late but it's uh, at all universities in in poland it starts in march usually mm. march semester uh, the summer semester lasts uh, usually until the end of uh, june then there is a, a holiday break by three months and the classes in the winter semester starts from the 1st of October. Um, answering the question of Eda, yes, we have career center and we have the students to find a job and to find uh, find a apprenticeship apprenticeships. Mm, so if you have any problems with finding a jobs, we can help you. We also have a uh, money technological and business partners which which gives students to to find and the job employment and uh, and internships mm. about the minimum gpa requirements for masters um it also should be if you have a master, bachelor diploma in Turkish University, this diploma should also give you, uh, with this diploma, you, you should be able to undertake studies in Turkish universities. So uh, in our university, you have the same, uh, the same right. Uh, right.
Have you more questions? Okay, if you do not have any more questions, I think that will be all for now. Uh, as I thought, I will get all your email addresses and your names, so soon I can contact with you personally by email and answer and give you the detailed information about our university, about the available programs in this academic year and the next one. Mm, about the living conditions in Poland, in which city, and other available opportunities. Okay, thank you all for participating. Yes, Kasper, thank you very much for your presentation. Uh, we believe it was a really informative webinar for the attendees, and you put a real effort answering the questions. Also, I would like to thank the participants in Turkish as well. Katıldığınız için teşekkür ederiz arkadaşlar. University of Humanities and Economics in Lozla ile ilgili diğer sorularınız için Kesper'in paylaşmış olduğu mail adresinden iletişime geçebilirsiniz. Aynı zamanda sizi altıdaki webinarımıza da davet etmek isteriz. Thank you again, Kesper. It was a pleasure to have you in IFT Talks. Is there anything you would like to add before we add up? Thank you very much. Uh, to all participants and I am inviting you to studies at the University of Humanities and Economics in Łódź. Thank you. All right, thank you. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.